First tonight at 5.30, making buses and big rigs safer. Good evening to you again. I'm Michelle Kingsfield. And I'm Marsha Baumhart. Troopers step up enforcement after a deadly accident. Jordan Burgess is live to tell us what's being done to protect drivers. Their office is behind the wheel, but starting tomorrow, truck and bus drivers will have the bosses looking over their shoulders, so to speak. And that's a good thing, considering the troublesome stats we found out about and some recent headline-grabbing crashes. The locations change. Chicago, Virginia, New York. But the scenes are similar. Buses now as twisted as the faces of the passengers who were on board when they crashed. In light of uh, some of the recent events, um, it's important that we take a look at those and make sure that the drivers are in good condition to get those people to their destination safely. That's why buses will be one of the focuses of this year's road check. Road check is a national effort to inspect commercial vehicles and their drivers. We're looking for any type of uh, violation that might uh, be a crash causing or a danger to others on the road. Flat tires, insecure loads, brake violations. We were surprised by how many violations troopers generally find. Last year, 1,900 inspections were done in Ohio. In about 30% of the cases, the driver or their vehicle was placed out of service. That's nearly one in three that posed a danger on the road. It is uh, an effort for us to contribute to a safer Ohio. Troopers say the checks are not only about looking at the vehicle, but also the person at the controls. But we're also taking a closer look at the driver, too, whether they're driving within the, the hours that they're allowed to be driving. Are they impaired? Are they sleepy? Now, road check starts tomorrow and runs through Thursday. Troopers tell me they'll have roving patrols along with checks at rest areas and scale facilities for those trucks and buses. Reporting live, Jordan Burgess, 2 News on your side.